So you've built your AI powered SaaS app and you've launched it and you've got users and you know that AI is a mission critical part of your app. Wouldn't it be amazing to have the peace of mind that if the open AI API went down, you could just fall back on using uh, Claude by Anthropic uh, or if, if Claude was no longer available, you could swap over to OpenAI and that your app would handle those changes, it would have an AI fallback. Well, I'm gonna show you something that I can't believe I've only just discovered in this video, but before I go into that, if you're wanting to build no-code AI-powered apps, then you should definitely, after watching this video, click the link down in the description because we've got hundreds of bubble no-code app building tutorials on our website, planetnocode.com. But here is what I found and what I've been experimenting with in the last 24 hours. It is called the Cloudflare AI Gateway. Now, if you've been doing web development, web design, as long as I have, you will definitely have heard of Cloudflare. But if you haven't, Cloudflare is kind of the gateway to the internet for many people, not like your ISP, but in the sense that so many websites sit uh, with Cloudflare sitting between you Cloudflare and then the website. In fact, they've got a really cool demonstration about generating uh, cryptography keys uh, using lava lamps. It's well worth checking that out. Anyway, I digress. Uh, one of the more recent offerings that Cloudflare has um, added in is uh, this AI gateway, and it effectively sits in the middle between your app and your AI provider. And you can connect directly through to OpenAI and you can get uh, access to a whole load of useful data such as logs, such as caching. I mean, what if someone was to ask the same question uh, to your AI, it doesn't need to check each time or can you just provide the cached answer? You can all do that with the AI gateway. But what I wanna draw your attention to right now is this ability to provide fallbacks. So if you've worked with Bubble, the Bubble API connector, you've worked with uh, AI APIs, this will all look fairly familiar to you. Um, so all we're doing is saying, we're gonna to connect to a particular endpoint that we get uh, and we can copy straight out of our Cloudflare account once you set this up. Uh, and then we are saying here, first of all, use uh, the workers AI. So this is actually uh, AI LLMs hosted on Cloudflare, in this case, Llama, but this could be open AI. And so we're saying first run this query through uh, Llama. But what if Llama fails? Well, we just add in another one. And so then we're saying uh, immediately, if Llama fails, then use OpenAI. And according to the documentation here, you can just add as many fallbacks as you like just by adding another object to the array. So if you want that peace of mind uh, and you have a uh, production uh, ready uh, app and you've got users on it and you don't want them to be getting all of these errors when one of these AI providers goes down, you can use the Cloudflare AI gateway to add a fallback AI. You can have multiple fallback AIs uh, so that you get working AI to your users consistently. And I'm gonna do more videos on this, including uh, rate limiting, custom metadata, getting log data through uh, Cloudflare AI Gateway. Like I said at the start of this video, I can't believe I've only just heard of this and only just playing with it. So it's well worth checking out.